Alright, we're, we're currently in the primary room right now, and uh, we have some serious issues that need to be addressed. Carlos is going to kind of walk us through uh, each part of the primary room and exactly what needs to be done. At the end, I'll ask you about what the estimates are, but if you could just walk us through uh, what the work is and what the work needs to be done. Okay, just to give you a brief um, summary, uh, real quickly, we actually got about five estimates. Uh, so far, the best estimates is what I'm going to go by, but let me just start by showing you exactly what I'm talking about. Here, we have um, some major leaks. Uh, it's coming from the overflow uh, of the uh, gutters, and uh, what we're trying to do is trying to see what, whether or not the roof needed to get done first, or if it was just to replace the gutters. Turns out it's just the, the overflows that need to be replaced. The roof is good, so that's good news. All right, and as we walk through, there's issues over here as well, and it's the same thing, has to do with overflow, it's nowhere anywhere else but the section where it's, uh, you know, going down to the gutter. And what, when you say overflows, what do you exactly mean by that? Because I don't know what that means, maybe you can explain that. Well, basically what has to happen, obviously, we're going to need some people that are going to be able to maintain or volunteer to, every once in a while, just to go up on the roof and to clean out the gutters, because what happens is when you have compost, leaves, or debris, or whatever, people throwing things from the building, unfortunately, next door, and it uh, block blocks the uh, gutter, and it can't overflow into the drain, what happens is water finds its way in somehow, and that stuff pushes the weight and makes it go into, into the roof, into the corners of the roof, and so once we clean all that out, and also replace the, the existing overflow, because they're no good anymore, um, it should flow, and we shouldn't have any more of this problem. Okay, so that's, uh, you're going to show me a couple other areas that, that's attached to the primary room that also has the same issue. Right. So let's go check it out. We're, okay. right, we're right outside the nursery, and Carlos is going to show us another area. Once again, it's the same situation here. Here, this is a little bit more of the roof. Uh, we've already discussed this section with the contractors. Uh, it's a small section of roof that needs to be replaced. And um, it's over here, it's pretty much the same problem. It's been compost, debris, uh, stuff just put in weight with water, and it's been sitting there settling, not going anywhere. So basically, we need to be able to clean that out on a regular basis so that won't happen again. But in the meantime, this roof itself it's, um, needs to be replaced, the section of roof. Is that the and same thing with over here in this section? Absolutely. This is part of it. It also comes from the top floor, which we're going to show you in a minute that the, uh, the top portion of the roof is also caving. It's getting so bad the actual brick is coming off the wall. So that needs to be addressed right away. And it turns out that because it's going through the brick, now it's going through the foundation as well as the roof, and it's actually going on the inside here. So we need to address that, address this as soon as possible. Okay, more in a second.